welcome back to Smart Studio where it's never too late to learn. On this video, we will show you how to type in Korean using your computer keyboard. We hope na you always practice your writing pa rin ha, para mag-form na rin kayo ng muscle memory sa pagsulat. And this time, muscle memory naman sa pag-type sa keyboard ang gagawin natin. Dahil pag nag-keyboard na po kayo, ay bagong muscle memory na po o skill memory, tawag ng iba, ang susubukan nating mabuo. So, Shijak Hapshita! Let's begin! There! Ngayon alam nyo na po kung ano-ano mga katumbas ng bawat keys ating keyboard, yung katumbas nilang Korean character. So, remember the power of repetition, okay? Repeat, 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 repeat practicing, okay? So, I will share naman sa inyo kung paano ko po ginawa na ma-memorize yung keys ng aking keyboard. Just I just use the power of repetition as I always repeat also to you guys. Um, repetition kasi it will help you form your muscle memory at yung iba't ibang memory na meron tayo. So, we must make time also. Okay? Also, one another tip is we must make time para mag-practice tayo ng actually sa kahit ano man, ano man na bagay, di ba? Um, we make time to practice, to do things para um, makaform nga tayo ng memory. And, we must make time also para ma-practice natin itong new skill na ito in order to form skill memory sa ating pag-type sa keyboard. Pwede po kayong mag-schedule, for example, 15 minutes a day kung yun lang ang meron kayong spare time or 30 minutes or 1 hour. So, ang pinakamalaga is make time. Bigyan natin ng oras na mag-practice tayo nito, okay?
So we must just uh, we just type kung anong combination of keys natin. So consonants and vowels. So ito naman yung bagong exercise natin. We start with kiyok and then each vowel followed by niyin and then each vowel ulit hanggang matapos natin yung lahat ng consonants together with a uh, kakombine natin sa bawat um, nating um, basic vowels starting with kiyok and so on and so forth. All right? Now, alam na natin kung ano-ano yung mga katumbas ng bawat key sa ating keyboard na katumbas nilang Korean character. So, we must use the power of repetition as I always tell you guys. Repeat the process para ma-form na yung muscle memory natin. Practice natin yung combinations ng consonants and um, vowels natin. And gradually, build your skill memory. Okay, so we hope na nag-enjoy po kayo and we hope na nakapag-share kami ng very useful knowledge para sa inyo para makatulong sa inyong Korean language learning journey dito sa Smart Studio where it's never too late to learn. Kamsa hamnida! Annyeong!